Hi, I'm Casey Gray. Even having my computer destroyed by the AdMech cannot stop me, and I have 90 seconds to tell you about the origins of Commander Farsight. The greater good of the Tau Empire has basically two heroes. The two great protégés of the legendary Commander Puretide, known as Commander Shadowsun and Commander Farsight. In his early career, Farsight led his forces to victory over orc armies outnumbering them a hundred to one, time and again. Against the orcs, anyone would be a tactical genius if they knew how to employ maneuvers more sophisticated than get em. But when he and Shadowsun fought together in the Damocles campaign against the Imperium, Commander Oshova gained the moniker Farsight for the borderline prescient ability to perfectly anticipate and exploit an enemy's actions. Farsight started getting salty that his forces weren't receiving adequate support, and when all of the ethereals sent with his expedition to reclaim the planets were abruptly and unexpectedly killed by an unknown enemy, he ignored the standard protocol to retreat and wait for new ethereals to tell him what to do. Instead, he stopped taking their calls and forged on ahead to set up his own colony of planets known as the Farsight Enclaves. The Ethereals didn't love being proven to be unnecessary, and branded him a traitor once they realized he was still alive. Leave a comment if you want to know what happens next, including the magic sword that has extended his lifespan by stealing souls for over three centuries. Maybe it's Xenotech, maybe it's Maybelline.